and Isa here, so I don't I don't know if you can see, but Mona is here. <laughs> Mona, how are you? How are you? We are filming. <laughs> Mona is here with me as I'm making this video, but uh, but yeah. So in this video, I wanted to talk about something I have discussed with my clients, and um, and yeah, just talking about like how I am able to. Um, how I'm able to keep uh, being fully recovered from my eating disorder, bulimia, because yeah, like I came from the binge eating, you know, I had like such a big problem with binge eating and not being able to stop eating and and I had uh, like I was so full and I was still, you know, like craving more food and and thinking about food all day and everything and, and obviously in my recovery, I went through the phase of extreme hunger and needing to respond to my res extreme hunger but also needing to stop all restriction I needed to stop purging, I needed to stop over exercising obviously I needed to stop all the intermittent fasting and dieting and everything I was so used to be doing and, uh, and thanks to that I actually reached to full recovery but also I want to talk about something that I have seen uh, with many people who still relapse in bulimia recovery or after being fully recovered from bulimia and it's to do with their mindset and especially the mindset regards to you know the binge eating because actually now as I have learned about recovery so much and also being like fully recovered myself and also like writing my book and everything I had to kind of educate myself to learn fully about recovery and what it takes and also why did I had the eating disorder bulimia in the first place and what I discovered was that uh, it was because of restriction it was because of dieting it was because of the compensating calories through purging or over exercising and in other forms and this is why I was binging and actually I wasn't even binging but it was already kind of like the um, response to famine response to starvation deprivation restriction it was my you know body's extreme hunger trying to keep me alive trying to do what is best for me but just uh, like my mindset took it as the binging like the, from the devil like something is wrong my hunger is out of control therefore it's kind of like I need to stop the hunger and I feel like um, many people who do relapse in their bulimia recovery because they call the relapse as them binging because I feel they fully haven't learned learned that there is no binging it's like extreme hunger or you being more hungry for some reason you don't even need to know the reason but actually you just need to trust your body that it has a reason maybe you were more active maybe it's the time of the month you know the hormones before your period or or after the period you know can make you feel more hungry or more like craving food in general who knows what kind of reason but there is a reason why you're more hungry or even let's say like when you're stressed out or when you feel like you're emotionally eating or something then don't deal with uh, you know like needing to stop eating if you're stressed out or you feel truly like you're eating emotionally or something then deal with the stress deal with the emotions or whatever you're going through but leave the food alone because the food is then the symptom right if the real cause is the stress or or being emotional or something then this is the cause like deal with the causes not with the symptoms if you deal with the symptoms the like increased hunger and you start to mess with your hunger you're gonna mess up this whole process and yeah you can find yourself in a relapse because uh, your hunger is not the problem your hunger is never the problem it never was it never will be but it's kind of like underlying like what's causing it it might be that you're just hungry naturally for some you know normal reasons such as being more active or maybe during the week you were very busy you didn't eat regularly so in the weekend you feel like oh my god i'm so hungry it can be normal or maybe you are just you know like going through the monthly uh, hormonal changes if you're female and uh, this is also very normal 
and nothing to panic about nothing to freak out so basically just to like trust your hunger trust your body whenever you are more hungry or less hungry and uh, in one of my videos on this channel i have also talked about how even normal eaters they don't eat the exact same amounts every day even for normal eaters their hunger fluctuates sometimes it's higher sometimes it's lower so it's normal but anyway what my whole point of this video is many people who recover from bulimia they still fear their hunger they still fear the binge eating or they haven't completely uh, understood kind of like the extreme hunger and that it's normal nothing to be afraid of and actually to be fully trusted and responded to and if you just respond to your hunger absolutely nothing bad's gonna happen and after being fully recovered from bulimia i have also went through you know like feeling lower hunger feeling more hunger feeling kind of like more normal hunger or like whatever label it doesn't even need a label but it's just like hunger increases sometimes it decreases whatever the reason is and i just respond fully trusting my hunger and absolutely nothing bad happens and also i have seen that yeah like sometimes i have increased hunger sometimes uh, before my period i can feel more hunger i just respond i can eat a lot of food and and that's normal you know we are so taught to be afraid of our hunger but having hunger is healthy a person who is eating the less as possible i don't see it as particularly like healthy it can be that there is some kind of underlying reason like why they don't have any appetite maybe it can be a sign of an illness or something and maybe they are like so stressed out or something so having a hunger having an appetite is a sign of being healthy also having healthy regular digestion high metabolism and i just want to say that uh, i feel like one thing that truly keeps me being like fully recovered from bulimia is that i am not afraid of my hunger if i am hungry you know to the point of feeling it's extreme hunger or something i would respond but the difference is uh, compared to my eating disorder is the mindset because in my eating disorder when i had extreme hunger i was panicking i was like already thinking like oh my god what's going on i had such a like negative connotation with my hunger and with uh, you know increased hunger but now i have positive connotation i'm like yeah like i'm just hungry and let's eat something and i have no remorse i have no guilt i have no shame i never think that i should I don't know decrease the food the next meal or or shoot that or restrict uh, next day or something and also i see that my body regulates itself if i'm more hungry some days then maybe next day i am less hungry also i'm a lot like warmer which means my metabolism is higher whenever i eat more and this is how the body burns off the calories you know by itself my whole point of this video is that if you want to be fully recovered from bulimia for the rest of your life but you are still afraid of your hunger you still see extreme hunger kind of something bad or something unnecessary or something to avoid or even if you still see your hunger as binging which is it it's not it's extreme hunger it's normal even normal people's hunger cues fluctuate if you feel that you could relapse possibly if you have increased hunger or you feel you just binged or have an episode of extreme hunger i would say you need more work on your mindset regards to your hunger and making peace with your hunger and really starting to trust your body and trust your hunger and uh, and also i think this it's not necessary it doesn't mean that this is something a person is doing wrong or but i feel like um like so many recovery approaches still uh, don't talk about extreme hunger and not just recovering from anorexia that many maybe more people are kind of like accepting yeah like you're underweight or you don't have your period so it's kind of like normal to eat more because you need to gain weight but especially somebody who is recovering from bulimia and they are maybe in normal weight or even like overweight or something i feel like this is where many people haven't caught up the fact that yeah even people who have bulimia and they are even like normal weight 
also they can have extreme hunger and it's normal and you still need to respond but what you need to stop doing if you have bulimia is to stop compensating calories through perching or over exercising or intermittent fasting or dieting or you know all the other types of restriction and follow your full hunger and then over time your binging will stop the extreme hunger will pass and you're gonna be fully recovered but to maintain the recovery you have to fully grasp the idea, grasp the idea that your hunger was never the issue only the restriction was physical restriction but also mental restriction and the diet mindset but i just want to reassure you again there is nothing wrong with your hunger and for a full recovery from bulimia you forever have to be making peace with your hunger and never be afraid of the binging or extreme hunger or just increased hunger like whatever it is because then you will maintain full recovery for the rest of your life so yeah so this is my video today and uh, please like this video and also subscribe to my channel and i will see you in the next one bye